Oh, no, 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 no. I am so pale. Ah! Don't look at me. Don't look at me. Ah! Don't look at me. I'm so pale. I'm me. Ah! All right, I'm over it. <laughs> what is going off with this hair day today? It's really quite a bad scene. Oh, and I'm zooming in. Good morning, everyone. Welcome back. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to my vlog channel. So today is the, what day is it? The 7th of December. Am I correct? I am correct. It's the 7th of December today. I've really not done much since we've been able to come out the house and since we've been able to like go places and do things. I went to the Arndale the other day and it was just the busiest thing and the most stressful experience of my life. And I just thought, you know what? This is not worth it. So I'm going to go back home and I'm not going to leave the house again. So that is what I've been doing. My lockdown has, um, you know, extended a week since we've been able to go out the house and I have done nothing. I really, really, really want to go to like a garden center or walk around town and see all the Christmas lights and stuff. So I might do that later on today. However, that has not quite happened because it's now 11 o'clock. In fact, it's like quarter to 12. Oh my God, how am I getting all this information right? It's quarter to 12 and I am not out of bed yet. I'm literally still in bed. I have my dressing gown on because it's freezing in our house today. We've been having the heating on and I think my body's got used to the temperature of the house when the heating's on. So I just literally jumped out of bed for my just again, ran to the heater, turned it on and ran back to bed. But I actually need to get up now. I need to make myself some breakfast. I need to do a bunch of things. I need to get back into it. I need to go to the gym at some point. I'm really like slacking on a lot of things right now, <laughs> including YouTube. I've really not um, posted much. Just because I, this is a situation. I work full time pretty much as a video editor for other people. So then when it comes to editing my own videos, I've already sat for the past 12 hours editing. The last thing I want to do is then edit especially my own voice like that is not the most fun part of my job you know so that's the situation i need to get out of bed i need to make some food i might look see if there's any space in the gym also the other day i was shopping in arndale and i picked up <laughs> this is sounds so dumb i just saw it i'm like oh my god that's cute and i want it so i picked up this little rubik's cube and i know it's a small one i kind of wish i got a big one now but i cannot fucking do it i've seen like so many methods online and like watched so many tutorials it's just annoying me every time i see it i get annoyed because i just want it to be right and i want the satisfaction of knowing that I've done it and even if I do it by following a tutorial I feel like I still get the same satisfaction and it's been three days and I cannot and I repeat cannot seem to do it don't know if I've showed you on my vlog channel yet um, but this is the Christmas tree I need to at some point wrap these cardboard boxes to make it look like we've got presents under the tree but this is the situation I really don't know what I've vlogged like I'm filming this now I'm really like I'm having some like deja vu that I've already done this and what I keep doing is I keep starting a vlog or saying hi everyone I'm gonna vlog today and then I don't end up finishing it or don't end up doing anything. So then it just sits on my SD card and then I end, end up with a full SD card of me just being like, hi everyone. So hopefully that doesn't happen again today. Not that I've really got any plans at all, but I at least just wanna, you know, do some fun things. And by fun things, I don't know what they are. Also, look at these. We have like these anal bead looking things. I don't know if you see my main channel, you've probably seen these already, but I think it looks nice. Like, does this not look nice? I think it looks nice. Anyway, we need to put candles in these. <gasps> That's what I'm gonna do today. I bought these candles the other day because I keep seeing on TikTok everyone doing the thing where they like bend the candles. So I bought those the other day from Ikea. So that is what I'm gonna do today. But first, it's salmon and egg time. And I feel like I've got one egg. Oh, I have two, brilliant. Right, everyone, I have had my breakfast. I've just got myself dressed. I'm a little bit more presentable. I got some jeans on. I haven't worn jeans in a while. I really want today to go on the sunbed. Now, I know everyone's going to kick off in the comments, and I know I shouldn't really be saying this in my vlog. And I feel like a lot of YouTubers just pretend they don't go on the sunbed, but I'm not going to be that bitch. I um, am not advising anyone uses the sunbeds, but I do use the sunbeds. And I haven't used the sunbeds, obviously, because we have been in lockdown. But today, I'm going to do it. And I know this health risk, and I know it's dumb, and I know I can, I can already hear and read all the comments. However, it's my life, not yours. But I do appreciate the concern and I also am not here to promote it and influence people to do what I'm doing. I know it's fucking stupid, I do, trust me. But like I said, people do stupid shit and I'm not trying to be a role model to anyone. So don't do anything ever I do because it's probably not gonna end well. But I'm gonna do it anyway. So I'm literally gonna go to the sunbed now. I need to quickly just put a wash on because let me show you how much washing I've got. It's really just quite ridiculous. But I have a lot of washing and it's making me feel ill. Every time I open my wardrobe, in fact, I can't even open my wardrobe at this point because there is an obscene amount of washing that needs to be done. So I'm gonna do this before I go. So I'm just gonna separate it all out. I'm not gonna film it because it's just gross and I'm gross and as a human I deserve none of this so 
I'm gonna put this in the wash and then be on my way. The beanie is on the first time this year I'm wearing a beanie. This is the current situation. I've separated all my washing out. I've got my towels there, my greys and my whites and then my blacks. There's already some in the wash, so I'm gonna come back. Hopefully by the time I get back, that'll be nearly done. Um, I really don't know how I'm feeling about this beanie, but it's also cold. So I'm just gonna go to the shop. This is my outfit. Ta-da, ta-da. Time to go and hopefully get a tan. But I don't go and do this, so just ignore what I just said. But this is what I'm doing my day, and I'm not about to lie. <coughs> I literally just forgot I was vlogging, but I've just made myself some food. I am now eating said food. I literally haven't had food like this in such a long time. I didn't really eat much throughout lockdown, which is really, really bad. I just got into a really lazy routine of not doing anything. Then it came to cooking food, I was like, mm. <coughs> No. So I made myself my old go-to chicken and veg. That's bloody lovely, actually. Once I've done this, however, my day is going to get very boring because I've got to work. So, love that. And now this is going to be where I'm going to be sat for the next few hours. Editing up Miss Saffron's video. Let's go. Good morning everyone, I have had quite the morning and in all honesty I've only just got out of bed I woke up this morning at 9am and it's just not been the greatest morning So I've literally just decided at the grand time of half past two to actually get out of bed and eat I feel like I had all my energy drained out of me this morning I'm not going to get into what it is and what the situation is However, I'm vlogging now because I want to distract myself I've literally laid in bed all day And because I've had nothing to do, like I got all my work done the other day Because I've had nothing to do, I've sort of just been sat thinking And it's driving me insane and I'm stressing myself out And it's just not, not a very productive time I think the weather also is shit So I've literally been laid in bed Trying not to cry my eyes out whilst looking outside at the rain And it's just not, not really helping me up here, do you know what I mean? So I've decided I'm going to pick up my camera I'm going to vlog today I'm going to use you guys as my distraction So all this vlog is, is me distracting myself So... Hopefully you find some entertainment out of this and hopefully this helps me. In fact, I know it will. Whenever I vlog, I literally forget about everything else that's happening in the world. So I'm currently making myself some noodles. It was a Dior show this morning, so I actually woke up. So I got invited to the Dior show. What the fuck? Like, I feel like Emma Chamberlain when she's like, doing a fashion show from home. However, I got invited to the Dior show, which is so fucking exciting, but also really sad because it would have been like, if COVID wasn't a thing, it would have been in real life and that would have been like such a cool experience. However, I watched it. Beautiful. It's really, really cool actually. I feel like it's a lot different from a lot of the stuff that's been done in the past. It's very colorful, very fun, very cool. I really really do like it so I watched that this morning and then I just literally been laid on my phone trying to distract myself and yeah I also you know something's wrong with me when I start cleaning and as you can see I've already done two washers so you know there's a little bit something something spicy going off right everyone so I've literally just been down for post now I just finished up my noodles I didn't film anything I've just realized for like the past hour I've honestly just been listening to a podcast I've been listening to Zane and Heath's Unfiltered and I went downstairs and I'm so freaking excited as I said this morning I watched the Dior show got invited to it I just, this is never not going to be weird. Like, this is always going to be like a what the fuck moment. Um, so, I guess let's see what Dior has sent me. I am so freaking excited because I think I already know what it is. <laughs> so, there's a bunch of people that are part of like the UK Dior boys team. I'm one of them and I follow like quite a few of them on Instagram. And I saw everyone unboxing parcels this morning and there's like a variety of like things that people have been sent. And one of the things that, I've not opened this yet by the way, but this is the size of the box. One of the things that I saw people get sent is the cutest fucking little card holder in the world. I have a card holder currently. Where is my card? So in my bag I have the cutest little card holder now which I actually got for my management team last Christmas as you can see. I don't know if I could should cover my cards. Um, it's just an Aspen of London one and it has my initials on it and I absolutely love it. However it's like a green croc print and it's cute and I love it but it just you know the vibes. Green croc print don't know if that's me. So I saw people unboxing this fucking card holder from Dior. And if it's that, I swear to God, I was gonna buy myself this for Christmas. Oh, 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 I don't wanna see it, I don't wanna see it, I can't even open it. Oh, I love a little bag. Oh my God, it is, it is, it is, I can feel it, it is. Oh my fucking God. Oh my God, it literally matches my bag. Oh my God. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, what? I feel like that's just made my bad day good. Like, you know what? Of any day that this could have arrived, I'm glad it arrived today because I feel like I needed that serotonin boost. And oh my God, it is so beautiful. I'm literally gonna swap all my cards over into my new card holder. I love it. Beautiful. Thank you so much, Dior. The show was beautiful. The card holder was beautiful. I love you guys. I'm gonna ring my mom. I mean, shock, I can't lie. Oh my goodness, I look so gross. Good morning everyone. Um, hi, it's me. 
It's me, the one who starts a vlog and never fucking ends it or carries it on or anything. So hi, I'm back. Um, we got it. I'm probably not going to end this vlog, but I'm trying. I'm trying. It's two Thursday. Oh God, I thought it was Tuesday. It's Thursday the 10th of December. I cannot believe how fast December's gone. That the rest of this year has absolutely dragged because of COVID. And then the only month that everyone's like, all right, let's just have this month. We can have fun, but a Christmas spirit. It's now, um, you and I all being sped up and time's been moving quicker lately so I'm a bit like what the fuck's going on? Can I get my contact lens in? Here we are, bish bash bosh. Um, so yeah, I'm just a little bit like what the fuck is going off? Why is time suddenly like going 9,000 miles an hour? But I want to enjoy Christmas. Also, I don't know if these contacts are out of date. When I put a reminder in my phone when I need to change my contacts. Oh, tomorrow. Tomorrow is the day that I need to change my contacts. So these are the last day. Anyway, today I have a really boring day. So I thought I'd, you know, film because like, what the fuck else do I do? I have a doctor's appointment in literally half an hour. So that's why I put my contacts in so I can actually drive my car with my eyes in check. So yeah, that's the situation today, girls. Every time I put my contacts in, my nose runs. <laughs> this is not about the drip. It's not about the drip. I need to dry my hair. I actually need to get a move on because parking at the doctor's is horrendous. And last time I was late and had to cancel my appointment because I was trying to park my car. Let's get going. Right, I've just been to the doctor's. All is good, all is well. I'm just now in TK Maxx and oh, that mirror is lovely. I'm gonna get some Christmassy stuff. This is what I'm after. How much is it? <laughs> 16 pounds, are you fucking joking? Oh, I think I shall get it. Success. I know I literally were like, oh my god, 16 pounds. But then I thought what my plan was is if, if I couldn't find anything like this, I was gonna go to a Christmas tree farm and like buy bits of like stuff that's come off Christmas trees or like try and find some and then just use it. And I also thought mm, that's probably gonna bring bugs into the house. So I'd rather pay 16 pounds, have this forever and not risk getting bugs in my house, you know? Success. I'm now gonna go home. I did a little shop in St. but I didn't film any of it because I went on the phone to my mum whilst I was walking around. But that's the situation. I'm gonna piss my pants as well. Nowhere has toilets. Like, that's Sainsbury has a toilet, but um, that's Sainsbury, that Sainsbury's has a toilet, but because of Covid I couldn't fucking use it and I'm gonna piss my pants. So, wish me luck, good luck Charlie. Mm, my room is so tidy, I forgot that I did this before I went out. Wow, love it. Anyway, I'm now back home. I need to take the bin out, it fucking stinks. Um, so that's amazing, I'm so glad that um, the bin smells lovely. These. These, this is the current situation. I have some stuff from Home Sense, which I actually got the other day, so I'll show you what's in there. In fact, no, I won't. Maybe I will. Maybe I won't. Maybe I will. Who knows? Anyway, I need to unpack my shopping. Obviously, I picked up this from TK Maxx. I need to unpack my shopping. I didn't really get much. Well, I got a bag full, but like, I don't really feel like I got much because I have a lot of frozen stuff, and obviously, I'm going home for Christmas soon, but I didn't want to do like a massive food shop and then just be stuck with things, so I literally just got, I just got what I needed, some essentials. I got my eggs out of the car as well, which I have haven't checked if they smashed. I'm not sure how they're doing. Oh, they're all good. I forgot they're in my car, so they've been rummaging around in my car for a couple of days now. Did anyone else used to watch Zoe's vlogs where she'd literally do like a haul of everything she got in a food shop? I used to literally watch it all and think, oh, I'm hungry. So sorry if this is making anyone hungry. Oh, picked myself up a chocolate orange, could it was it. And then I got some chicken and some cod. The other day I made the nicest cod curry like ever and I don't think I can make it again. And also I don't want to try and make it again because if it doesn't taste exactly how the last one tasted, then I'm going to be disappointed. I don't feel like a failure. So I feel like whilst things are good, I may as well leave it on that good note. Um, so I'm gonna unpack this now, make myself some food because all I've had to eat today is a packet of Pool Loops, which is not good at all. I really need to sort my eating out. Literally, since this lockdown, everything I started to work towards has gone out the wind's eye. It's gone. Don't know what's happened, but it's gone. It's not here anymore. The intercom on the wall keeps ringing downstairs. Every so often, we just keep hearing someone's voice be like, Hello, oh my god, I've got hiccups just so I'm about to start vlogging. Anyway, I really don't know what I've just filmed or what the last clip you'll have seen is because I started re-filming or filming part of my main channel video. I basically dressed the table, I'm gonna make myself a hot chocolate and stuff. However, before I do any of that, I just thought I'd make myself some boiled eggs on toast. This is like my favorite thing in the world right now. I honestly don't know why, but there's something about it. I think it's from watching Zoe. I'm just watching Zoe's vlog most. I think from seeing Zoe make such nice looking eggs on toast, it just inspired me. So we got a toaster not long ago. So we didn't have a toaster for the longest time living here and it was just like, we didn't think we'd need one, but then we'd go to make certain things and be like, oh, we don't have the toaster, what the hell? So, now we have a toaster, I'm taking full advantage. Oh my God, these eggs smell eggy. I'm making myself some lovely eggs on toast, but I can never peel the egg. 
or the shell of the egg. It always fucks up. Guys, I know this doesn't look good and like my presentation's not there and I really could have like put my eggs on top of it, which I am gonna do. But trust me, this will taste amazing. And now I'm gonna watch Zoe's vlog whilst I eat it. And then I'm gonna watch a Christmas film. So let's go.